This is a prison in space, and to simulate space- Wait a minute, Burger Shirker is in prison? Dude, I was right the whole time. It's 2022, I know we'll see it through, thought we could stop the year- Yo, what's up guys? So today is a glorious day, because today is the day that the, uh, the dark- <laughs> The Dumpy and, and and Burger Churger fan fictions will be read in full, you know, um, I guess we're getting married soon. Also, super off topic, but I just have to mention this. Burger Churger's boyfriend, Twice Shorts, unfollowed me off Twitter. Dude, why? Like, you're breaking my little heart. Like, we were actually talking in the DM. I thought we were friends. He even promoted his little YouTube story for me to watch it, and I actually did! A and then he just unfollows me off Twitter? He basically just killed me in real life. Like, I'm dead now, dude. Like... What the fuck? But anyways, guys, my life has been in utter ruins and shambles because recently I've been just getting so many messages on Discord, Twitter, like just pretty much just all saying that I should collaborate with Burger Churger in the bedroom. And I just don't know how I feel about that. Like, dude, any day of the week, I'll be down to tackle a Minecraft YouTuber in the bedroom. Like... <laughs> I just don't know about any obese ones, man. But like I mentioned earlier, guys, we have, um, <laughs> the dumpy Burger Trigger fanfiction. And guys, the title's clickbait. Okay, the title's clickbait because it's not just a fanfiction. There's two fanfictions. I think the end of humanity as a whole is upon us because just what the fuck? I have been shipped on YouTube with this man. <laughs> I don't even know if this is him or not, guys. I just have a slight feeling that something's just gonna go terribly wrong in my life. I just hit myself with my mic. Like, I have a feeling I'm gonna wake up tomorrow morning next to Bee's Churger in bed or something. Like, I, I I don't know, dude. Something's going to happen. This could very well be the last video on this channel. And, I mean, honestly, I think I'm fine with that. Because I know these fan fictions are about to be so spicy and so creamy. Dumpy X Bee's Churger, March 6th, 2022. Damn, dude, I'm behind on this one. Dumperman is hard at work. Watching a bees trigger BC. <laughs> Why the emoji, man? I can't even like see what that emoji is. Is it like someone holding a finger over their face? Like, shh, don't tell anyone. Literally, like when Burger Sugar sneaks into his kid's room at night and the other kid wakes up and sees, shh, don't tell mom. Um, okay, uh, that might have been a little bit too far. Uh, I'm sorry. Dumper Man is hard at work watching a bees trigger video to provide content for his loyal little sub why would he put little subs they're literally trying to portray me as lion maker studios dude no you're not little subs dude what the f whoa 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 no 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 you cannot say that bad word you cannot put a bad word in your fucking video i'm eight years old i'm only eight have i said that as these words leave dumpy's mouth he thinks to himself will this be it will this be the video that reaches the hearts of millions will i finally Dumpy's mind goes blank. He feels a chill go his spine. Uh, I'll, I'll just run with it. Dumperman looks over his only... What? Maybe my subs are little, bro. He can't even speak English. Is this like a two-year-old? Like, who wrote this, man? This is such a bad look. Maybe all my subs are like actual fetuses. Dumperman looks over his only to see the creature that's been haunting his nightmares for days. It was Bee's Churger. <gasps> I know right there I had a little sarcastic like screaming sat whatever the fuck going oh I'm not really that scared but dude honestly if I was working on a video like how I'm working on a video right now and I looked over my shoulder and I'm looking at B's Churger I would I would I don't know I don't know if I would fight him because he's like a human meatball or if I would run because also he's like a human meatball he would block the door it's just a lose lose situation like I think honestly dude Burger Churger should be a Mortal Kombat character he would always win don't be scared for his life at this point builds up the courage to ask the Burger Churger wait Beast Churger what are you doing here what are you doing here um, he didn't actually say that. Uh, Beast Trigger, what are you doing in my room? Don't be at this point, is covered in sweat. <laughs> uh, okay. He thinks by lying to the Burger Trigger, he'll defuse the situation. Maybe make him go away. Beast Trigger, I'm only eight. Dude, no! Beast Trigger covers Dumpy's mouth with his hand and whispers into his ear. Dumper man. Dumper man. Dumper man. I don't like being lied to. Is Burger Trigger gonna violate my butt, dude? I swear to God, if fucking Burger Trigger violates me in this, I'm gonna have actual nightmares tonight, like no joke. He pauses for a few seconds. The Burger Trigger gets even closer to Dumpy's ear. 
I don't like being made fun of Dumper Man. Dude, I hope this actually happens. It would just be so nice to have like cuddle time with Beast Trigger. <laughs> Dumpies is frozen in place with his mouth covered up by the big Bees Trigger. Why does he keep putting BC? Don't worry, Dumper Man. I'll tell you what I do like. He says in a seductive voice. Of course, I like to eat a lot. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I like to eat, Dumper Man. And unlike you, I am not a hateful person. I am not hateful. I am a good person, Dumper Man. He says slightly angrily. I am willing to meet your negativity with love, Dumper Man. Dude, he's gonna fuck. Beast Trigger slowly reaches into his pants with his other hand while maintaining eye contact with Dumpy. Dumpy is scared shitless. He has an idea for what the big burger trigger has planned. He just hoped it would be wet and painless. What the f- What? Dude, no. <laughs> No, man, this is not looking good. However, his fears were not met. Burger Trigger pulled out big, meaty, juicy, girthy cheeseburger. Burger Trigger removed his hand from Dumpy's mouth and gave him the sandwich. There's another page? I'm not gonna lie, a part of me kinda hoped that'll be the end because, like, that'll be a fucking nice ass uh, cliffhanger. Oh, look at that. He drew me with the burger, man. That's so sweet. Go on now. Eat it. I made it with love, Dumper Man. Something you and your hateful videos need. Burger Trigger said this while squeezing Dumpy's arm. Dumpy took the first bite. The smile on Burger Trigger's face couldn't be wider. He was in love. Oh, Dumper Man, he whispered. Dumpy looked up to meet his gaze once more. Yeah, man, I don't like a single thing about this fanfiction at all, dude. I have a slight suspicion that whoever wrote this really, really wants this to, like, actually happen. Dude, I'm just saying, man, if Burger Trigger ever ends up in my room one day, I will not be taken off my belt, dude. I'm not taking it off. Dumpy looked up to meet his gaze once more. He did not know what to think. The burger was pretty good, but yet he still felt like throwing up. Dumpy was sick to his stomach, eventually leading to a fart. A little gas that didn't go unnoticed. Dude, come on. You're like really doing this to me, man, on your little fan fiction. Come, no, man. As Dumpy was about to take another bite, he felt the might of Tyrone strike his face. Dumpy looked up from the ground to see an angered Burger Shirker. I'm sorry, Dumper Man. I tried. I really did try. I tried to be your friend, Dumper Man. I offered you my greatest gift, and you spat in my face. Beast Trigger picked the cheeseburger that was now on the ground up and picked Dumpy up by the throat. He sat Dumpy down onto his chair. You really can't be saved, Dumper Man. Your hateful videos, your hateful fans, even your hateful gas. It's a poison on this world. And I'm going to do something about it. Beast Trigger proceeded to forcefully shove the remaining burger down Dumpy's throat. Dumpy tried his best to struggle, but Burger Trigger's might was too much. Eventually, Dumpy died in his chair with a burger halfway down his throat. Fuck, man. Like, is this how I'm really gonna go out? By the hand of Burger Churger 97 Beast Churger left the premises and returned to making Minecraft shorts with all his pals. The end. Well, shit, dude. Thanks, Styro. Well, man, that sure was a family-friendly fanfiction, dude. Really nice and peaceful. Just making a video, then out of nowhere, you know, Burger Churger's behind me. I turn around. He then proceeds to feed me until I die. Honestly, man, if I don't die like this, I didn't live a good life. Sadly, though, there's even more cancer. We have the Churger Burger X Dumpy fanfic. Let's begin. Chapter 1, Hot Video. <laughs> What? On a bright Sunday morning, a tired, overworked Dumpy is about to go to sleep because of the fucked up, non-existent YouTube sleep schedule. So true. Then his phone goes boppity bop bop So he checks it, and guess what? His favorite YouTuber and celebrity crush, TriggerBurger73, has uploaded. Dumpy's face glows up as he screams in happiness. As Dumpy is checking the video, he realizes how hot it is. Dumpy stares at TriggerBurger's face cam and thinks to himself, Oh damn. He is so hot and sexy. Uh, guys, I, I, trust me, I do not think that. This guy right here, not attractive. Uh, maybe a little bit. Dumpy immediately contacts Trigger Burger via his business email. The email reads as follows. Hi, Trigger Burger. I've been watching your videos for like 70 years now, and I want you to know that you're my celebrity crush. Give me your Discord, hottie. Dumpy8038, that's my actual Discord, what? You so hot, I dream about you, but even my dreams cannot capture the hotness. Oh. <laughs> All your videos so sexy, yeah man. After about 5 seconds, he gets an essay sent to him on Discord by Burger that reads as follows. Hi, I read your email, and I just want to say, 
I've watched your videos as well, and I love you so much, hotness. Come over to my place, and that's the, uh, that's the White House, um, address. Chapter 2. The meetup, oh no. Dumpy immediately runs to the address, uh, <laughs> jumps into Trigger Burger's room through the window. They have a romantic stare into each other's eyes as they slowly embrace each other and share a long, intense kiss. N no. And then suddenly, Churgerberger's wife <laughs> enters the room and witnesses her husband kissing Dumpy. Oh man, dude, the kids are in ruins. Like, God damn, dude, Churgerberger, 30 year old man, he risked it all. The whole family for me. It's kind of hot. She screams, What the fuck are you doing kissing a fucking dog? I'm calling the cops, you disgusting psychopath. Oh my god, dude, he's gonna go to fucking prison. The intro was right. Chapter 3, The Arrest. Dude, I'm so excited. As the police arrive at the White House, Churgerberger and Dumpy share one last romantic stare before Churgerberger is taken away. He ends up getting put in prison for a year. As soon as Dumpy hears this, he runs towards the prison, and when he arrives, he sneaks in. Now inside of the prison, Dumpy runs and searches the entire prison before he finally finds Churgerberger 69. There he bites through the iron bars so Churgerberger can get- So Churgerberger can fit through and escape. He had to bite through a lot of bars since Churgerberger had eaten so many burger churgers. I like the realism. Then Dumpy is finally able to break Churgerberger out of his cell. Chapter 4. The escape. Dumpy and Churgerberger sneakily escapes the prison and run into the woods where they meet Jellybean. Fucking fuck. I guarantee you this man was like, Jellybean, what are you doing here? And I just like slapped the fuck out of him. They meet Jellybean, who says, hi Churgerberger, it's been a while. Yeah man, this was the old side hoe. Dumpy whispers into Churgerberger's ear, you gotta kill her. For us to be able to be together. Dumpy proceeds to give Churgerberger a sharp iron bar that he had bitten off. He intensely whispered to Churgerberger, do it. Churgerberger proceeded to run towards Jellybean and impale her in the eye with the iron bar as he tells her in a British accent, I'm sorry lad, it's for love. Then Churgerberger and Dumpy run away and live happily ever after. A fanfic by Churgerberger's evil child also, send medical assistance as I'm positive that I suffered a stroke <clears throat> when writing this. Well, shit, dude, I'll call the police for you, but man, two, two Burger Trigger fan fictions in one day. One second, guys. Kill me! Yo, guys, real quick, I wanted to say that for tomorrow's upload, I'm actually planning on making a Karen video. And um, I haven't made a Karen video in like almost a year, so if you guys actually want that, let me know. And if you guys don't want that, let me know. But um, if you want that, just comment down below like uh, water, okay? Comment down below water if I should make the Karen video. It's gonna be good, all right? It's a good topic, and uh, yeah, I'm actually kind of excited to make it. But um, anyways, though, guys, hope you all enjoyed today's video. I didn't. Ah, oh, dude, I'm just kidding, man. These burger sugar fucking uh. These Burger Sugar fan fictions were so sweaty. I mean, it, it it's changing my life for the better. But yeah, guys, anyways, if you enjoyed today's video, drop a like, subscribe if you are new, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys all in tomorrow's video. Have an amazing day or night wherever you are, and peace out. Wavy never land like Benny from the sand lot, calling my shot. The great Bambino, don't drink vodka unless it's Pellegrino. Traded two fives for a super steak burrito, super jack pomade, got me feeling like Rico. Pulling up a cha-cha. Call a sugar for honey bunch, nah nah, I'm fucking that, should've had my